we'll just try something else next time and hopefully we'll have some better results. Hi, hello. Today I'm going to be making some killer donuts from the severely underrated horror movie called Attack of the Killer Donuts. More specifically, I'm going to be making this donut. This is my absolute favorite. She's so beautiful. I'm going to be making her. So I bought the donuts. Yeah, I bought them. Sorry, I bought them. We're not making them. To me, it looked like a blueberry donut. So I bought some blueberry donuts, but we're going to be making that green goo around the mouth. We're going to be making those teeth and we're going to be putting it all together to make some killer donuts. I thought we could make the green goo now. Let's do it. So I'm going off of a recipe I found and I'm really, I'm gonna try to follow it really well, okay? Sort of, maybe. All right, so we combine water and starch. Okay, we're, okay, it's already too much. We're gonna combine the water and let's get our cornstarch out. And yes, this is the original box from last year. Let's whip out this cornstarch. I have never worked with cornstarch before. Uh, I don't use a lot of cornstarch. Yeah, and by the way, I have been making YouTube videos for a year now. On October 4th, it was one year since the first time I uploaded. Yeah. That's about an eighth of a cup, sure. So we're supposed to Whisk it in until the clumps are gone. Okay. I'm doing this right, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It looks like the clumps are gone. All right. And then we're supposed to whisk in the syrup. Whisking in the syrup. Microwave two to three minutes in one minute intervals. I hope this comes out. I hope this comes out. A few moments later. Um, what? What? Huh? Man, this damn cornstarch. It... I think we're just gonna smooth it out a little. This might work. You know what? Can we can we just admire how like beautiful like that looks for a second? Why is it so beautiful? So I got some green and I got some yellow. And we're gonna try to make a yellow green. <laughs> Let's start off with a little little drop of yellow. Boop. And then we'll do a green. And we'll just add the color little by little. Two more. Oh, three. Okay, that's it. We're done. Now that I'm looking at this, I'm like, it definitely was like a little looser. Let's put a little water in it. See, maybe that wasn't such a bad idea. Dancing. Oh. Okay, I got my stuff set up for the next part. I got these donuts. And I've got my teeth. I just took them out of the fridge. I'll show you how I made these. It's very much like how I made the fangs for the evil fortune cookies. I actually used the leftover modeling chocolate that I had. I just stuck in the freezer to make these. So if you're like trying to make this and you don't have leftover modeling chocolate, because who does, you know, just weirdos making stuff on the internet. You can uh, go to the description. I'll put the same link to the video I used to learn how to make modeling chocolate. Oh yeah. You're going to have to adhere them to the donut somehow. You could do that with maybe like a royal icing or if you're going to use something like not edible, probably use toothpicks or something. I overlooked this. And so what I did is I got really guyver like and I took a paper clip and I cut it up and I have these little metal 
spokes almost that I'm going to use. And if you're gonna give this to somebody, you would definitely warn them that these are in their donut. So I think what we should do is we should take out the donuts and then fit some teeth on it. So beautiful. I think I love it. Yeah. Oh my god, well the donut is delicious. I was gonna watch those paper clips. Okay. But I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye. So this is some Halloween costume, by the way. Um, can you can you guess what it is? Just do it. Perfect.